Coop, throw the ball to your sister. Fine. Here's something you can handle. <laughs> nice throw. Wow. What an arm. Get the ball, will you, son? But she, she. Oh. No, I'm going to take a goose ball. Oh, I can't even move the dumb sister. God, just get me. My shoe! Thanks a lot, Millie. <coughs> there you are. <laughs> Evil, careless creature, squirrel, Coop? beast, purple, which is the Calm creature down. Size, What's the matter? Rat. And what happened to your shoe? Where's the ball? <laughs> Evil, naked, sewer rat with beckings. Horrible, hairless eyes. <laughs> Millie! It's got her! It? Daddy, Daddy, look, look at what I found! Just the cutest kitty in the whole world. Wait, that's a cat? Oh, can I keep him, Daddy? Oh, please, can I, can I, can I, huh? Oh, please. Uh, he's got a collar, honey. He must belong to someone. Yeah, someone with really bad eyesight. <laughs> Sorry, Millie, but we can't keep him. Her, or it. We've got to find the owner. <laughs> All right, all right! If we can't find his owner, we'll keep him! Thanks, Daddy. And here's your ball. <laughs> That's my Knockleyville Cheddar Teaser signed consolation round baseball! Don't even think about it, son. But what about my ball? I gotta get it back! You know darn well that whatever or whoever enters old Lady Munson's yard is never seen again. And I really don't feel like dealing with her today. <laughs> What's oh, still, kitty? There! Don't you look precious? But you must be so hungry. That's better. Ugh. I've made enough posters to cover the whole neighborhood. I've decided that I'm going to call him Mr. Cat. Great name. Well, don't get too comfortable, Mr. Cat. I'm going to find your owner. Maybe Mr. Cat and I could help. Uh, sure. Goody! Come on, Mr. Cat! <laughs> there! <laughs> it worked! Finally, we're gonna get rid of that bald squirrel. Did you find my kitty? <laughs> we sure did! <laughs> Too bad. So sad. You found a cat? My dog is hungry. Try to swallow him whole. <laughs> Sorry.
sorry, son. I guess this means we'll be keeping Mr. Cat. Goody! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, Daddy. I'll take real good care of him. I'll feed him and watch him and see flea and paint him. <sighs> I think I need something for my ears. That cat is so out of here. <laughs> Let's see who you belong to, Mr. Cat. Whoa, this is one weird caller. You've really got it out for this cat, don't you, Coop? Why would you even think of blowing up his collar? And where'd you get the fireworks to do it? Ugh, I told you, Dad, it blew up by itself. Yeah, just finish cleaning up your mess and try to stay out of trouble. Uh, cat! Goodbye, Growler! What have we got here? <laughs> Quickly, boy. Oh, man. Now my lucky baseball is gone, too. <laughs> ah, so that's where she keeps all the stuff. <laughs> Mr. Cat! <laughs> that's a great idea! We'll play safari! Mr. Cat, the wild garden gnome is ferocious when startled. But Big Brothers are a whole nother story. Holy moly! do we have here? Hello, Mrs. Munson. Would you like to meet Mr. Cat? Oh, well, well. <laughs> Mr. Cat is very nice indeed. Too bad I can't say the same about your nasty brother. Alone, they're bad enough. Together, a guy doesn't stand a chance. <laughs> Can't draw. He's a cat. <laughs> That's no cat. It's some kind of alien. Coop! First you blow a crater in the backyard, then you sneak into Old Lady Monson's yard, and now this. <sighs> I never thought I'd say this, Coop. But go to your room. <sighs> Think, Growler. Perhaps Aloysius would enjoy some sun today. No, that won't do. He and Sir Scratch are up aren't speaking. Maybe he should visit with Tom Tuttle. <gasps> Tom Tuttle's is gone. <laughs> back in, back in! Is your brother up yet? Sourpuss is still asleep. Well, I hope he's had time to think about... Oh, Lady Munson! I'll get it. Billy! No! There you are, Mr. Cat. What have you been up to? Your juvenile delinquent son stole all of my confiscated toys and kidnapped Tom Tuttles! Coop wouldn't do a thing like that. I followed his footprints! No. Oh. But those are all left feet. We'll sniff him out, won't we, Growler? 
Tom Tunnels! Where are you, Tom Tunnels? Tom Tunnels! What the? Coop! You can't hide from... Coop, are you... What are... Why? I didn't do this, I swear! Where are the toys you stole from my shed? What? I didn't steal anything from your shed! Um... <laughs> Tom Tuttles! A toy thief! And a gnome napper! I'll deal with you later. I, I, I'm sure it's just a maze he's going through! <laughs> Daddy's gonna give you up for adoption. You! I don't know how you set me up, but... My shoe! So that's the way you want to play it, huh? Well, I'm ready for anything, cat! You'll be sorry you missed me with that rock! Um, isn't anyone gonna get me down from here? Anyone? Anyone see my book report? It's due today and I can't find it! Such a good idea. Oh. I'm not kidding, Dennis. Ever since that cat moved in, my whole life has been turned upside down. Lauren, Harley, what are you guys doing? Making our own horror movie? The, the suburban weed massacre. massacre. Whoa. We're transforming the face of contemporary horror. Yeah, it's gonna be wicked awesome. We're sending it to Ghastly Graves. He'll put it on his TV show for sure. <laughs> What's she trying to say? I can't hear you. Who's Ghastly Graves? Ghastly Graves, the host of Ghost Castle, the scariest show ever. It's on every night at midnight. Or is that too late for you babies? <laughs> Unless you're scared. Watch it tonight, Channel 9, Midnight. We're not scared of anything. Yeah, except spiders. Um, The Dark, Old Lady Munson, candy apples, werewolves, double-decker buses, uh, sometimes aardvarks. Oh, I don't think I can sit through this, Coop. Dennis, if we don't watch the movie tonight, Lauren and Harley will know we chickened out. Ah! Tune in tonight, viewers, for the Ghoulish Gala, Channel 9. Yeesh, it's just a commercial. She's right. We can do this, Dennis. You can vote for tonight's creature feature. Will it be zombie cat flesh eaters? <coughs> Attack of the Mega Leeches? <coughs> or Vampire Roller Derby? None of the above! I think I hear my mother calling Buckle! See you, Dennis! Call 555-0100! Right now! I can do this! I can do this! Each call costs 75 cents, and you can vote as many times as you like! Be sure to call in right away, viewers! There's only five more hours to vote! Five hours from now? Isn't that a um... The middle of the night? Dad'll let me stay up. Uh-uh. It's a school night. Dad won't let you stay up to watch some dumb movie. Oh, yeah? We'll see what he says when I use my powers of persuasion. No. But... It's past your bedtime. But... You have school in the morning. But... And scary movies give you nightmares. Did I forget anything? No. Told you so. <laughs>
All the votes have been counted. It's a landslide win with over 96,000 calls for tonight's ghoulish gala. Zombie cat flesh eaters. <laughs> Keep quiet. Well, I suppose you can clean out Mr. Cat's litter box for a month and your Fun Station 2000. No Fun Station! My Captain Blasteroid action figure? Three weeks of litter box duty. Two weeks! Two weeks, three days, and 12 hours, or I scream for dead. Deal! Okay, enjoy your bad dreams. Come on, Mr. Cat, it's time for bed. <laughs> Don't be afraid. It's just a movie. <laughs> Maybe I imagined it. It's a wonder he can get any sleep after you made him watch that creepy show. He's been here all night? Of course he has. Zombie cat, just like in the movie. 
Drive a wooden stake through its black heart! Or stuff its mouth with garlic. Then its head will explode. Watched that horror movie, didn't you? <laughs> I called what number? Ninety-six thousand eight hundred and forty times. It's how much per call? <gasps> I'll get it. Hey, Dennis, would you? <laughs> Look, it's Zombie Cat Boy himself. What's going on? Great performance last night, Coop. Better than the movie, even. Huh? Check it out. That cat is going down. <laughs> Coop, what did you do to Mr. Cat last night? He's all dusty. <laughs> You're right, Millie. Cat is dusty. Why don't you give him a bath? <gasps> Good idea, Coop. <laughs> this will fix you right up, Mr. Cat. <laughs> Look who's a scaredy cat now! up in my hockey bag. Can't hit the evil cat! And that's for using my shoe as a litter box. How could you destroy my evil feline genius? <laughs> and that's for deleting my favorite episode of Captain Blasteroid! <laughs> okay! Okay, Koopa! Okay, you... <laughs> Mr. Cat. Millie, that mutant mole needs to know I'm fighting fire with fire! Actually, Coop, you're fighting fire with water balloons. Oh, that reminds me. I'm out of ammo. What's that? This? It's the H2O Abominator Special. Gee, it looks so complicated. Oh, no, it's not complicated at all. See, you pull the sling taut, and then you put the water balloon into the bowl, and use the joystick to swing it around and change the trajectory. <laughs> What's this do? Um, it fires a balloon. <laughs> no! Don't touch that! Yeah, <laughs> oh! that was close! Uh-oh. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no! Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no! Why, Colonel Carpet Stink, you're so light on your feet. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no! Oh, no! It was an accident, old lady Mun... I mean, Mrs. Munson. Coop's very, very sorry. If that boy or anything belonging to him trespasses on my property, you will both be sorry! <laughs> I gotta get rid of that cat, Dennis. No matter what it takes. <laughs> what was that? Cat. Right on schedule. Okay, let's review the plan. Tonight, we sleep in the tent alone. Cat won't be able to resist attacking. And that's a good thing? Are you kidding? It's great! Well, he's attacking our dummy. We'll bag him and trade him in for a nice, quiet puppy. Or a monkey. Yeah, there he is! <laughs> We're surrounded! He's brought reinforcements! <laughs> Uh, they're not 
not so tough. Besides, we got enough candy and juice to keep us awake all night. Old lady, I mean Mrs. Munson, what are you doing in my yard? I was just going to ask you the same question. But how did... <laughs> Can I use your bathroom? I didn't think so. Michael! And now to deal with you, Burtonberger! What? Uh, you little... Ow! Burtonberger! I want every single petunia replaced that your hooligan son trampled with his tent! You gotta believe me, Dad. It was Millie's cat. No excuses, Coop. You've got to stay away from old Lady Munson. Time for our tea party, Mr. Cat. Oopsie. Out of tea. Be right back. Mind you, when I was your age, I couldn't stay out of old Lady Munson's hair either. I remember once I crashed my kite right through her kitchen window, and she came at me like... No wonder you can't keep that boy under control. You're as big a juvenile delinquent as he is. <laughs> no wonder I still see her in my nightmares. Don't you dare! <laughs> Stink and I know the only way to deal with a bad apple is to crush it into apple sauce. Yeah, how nutritious. I think I've got it fixed, Mrs. Munson. Then hurry up and bring it inside. Burton Burger! Okay, Dennis, hold this while I lay the bait. Just to be sure. may cause erratic or violent behavior in some cats. What does erratic mean? Tell me about it. 
Why do I have to fix the bird bath you broke? Mrs. Munson says to be sure to wash behind Tinkly Winkle Toe's ears. Fine. And use a sponge. The scrubber chafes. Why won't you believe me that Millie's cat did it? You can't blame Millie's cat for everything, son. It's time you took responsibility. You're right, Dad. I'll be right back. It has come to my attention that Cat needs a proper bed of his own. But why? He can sleep anywhere. Oh, and he does. Probably sleep on a bed of nails. Oh, one bed of nails coming right up. I have something a little more practical in mind. Ooh, a cat bed. <laughs> Mr. Cat needs something soft to sleep on. Here you go, Mr. Cat. Look, he likes it, he likes it. He's so cute. Uh, where'd you get that blanket? I found it in a shoebox on the top shelf at the back of your closet behind a sign that said, Keep out, Millie. I'm serious. <laughs> Here's your buba blanket. <laughs> Nighty night, baby coop. <laughs> Give me back my blanket! <laughs> I thought we put your baby blankie away the day you started kindergarten. And I took it back the day after I started kindergarten. <laughs> I get kind of stressed out. You're too old for that thing. It's musty and... <sighs> hey, you! Better put this in the wash before the neighbors start complaining. Oh, 
Spicy Frisky Bits! Cats know what they want and know how to ask for it! That's over. No! <laughs> oh, what could he possibly want now? Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Cat. I forgot to fill your bowl. Burger! Burger! Uh, kitty treats? Uh, yarn. Cats like yarn, don't they? <laughs> he stopped. <laughs> Hello? Yes, I know. I'm sorry. 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 I know. I'm very sorry. <laughs> this racket ends now. I went to the pet store and got that cat a new voice-activated collar. Oh, this looks good. Tough love for tough toms. 9,000 volts of corrective discipline per charge. The cat will prod 9,000. <laughs> we want a correct cat, not cook him. This is what we got. <laughs> Mind your P's and Q's, corrective collar guides your pet with firm yet gentle suggestion. <laughs> There. Now, we just put it on the cat setting. Now, now, pussycat. That behavior is most inappropriate. <coughs> Quiet, please. There's a good kitty. Can't we get one that'll give him a good jolt, too? Just to be sure. <coughs> Proper pussycats speak only when spoken to. <coughs> And stop repeating everything I say. <laughs> no hissies. You heard her. No hissies. <laughs> There's a good kitty. <laughs> No hissies, you hooligan. Someone should wash your mouth out with soup. Unhand me, you ruffian. Oh, oh, oh. My buckle is kitty proof. You leave me no alternative. <laughs> Hear that? You'll never get rid of that collar. Say bye bye to Blanky. Don't even think about it. A growing boy. What? Coop, you're late for school. Oh man, I overslept. Get a move on. Don't be late. Huh? Don't eat so fast. Chew every bite. Um, you say something? Millie, I said, did you say something? Yeah, did you? Don't talk with your mouth full. Okay. Walk, don't run. Did you say something? Why are you slouching? Sit up straight. Huh? 
Do you have something to say, Coop? Well, answer the lady. What? The caller! Shh, be quiet! Maybe you should go to the principal's office. Always listen to your teacher. <laughs> Even when her incompetence forces her to pass the buck to a higher authority. <laughs> Quiet, class. One more word, young man, and you'll have a detention. But, but... No buts about it. You're in trouble now. <laughs> okay, that's it. If you all think this is so funny, you can all have detention. <laughs> it wasn't me. Now would be a good time to run. <laughs> You certainly know how to make friends. <laughs> you! This is all because you took my blanket! Well, go ahead. He's asking for it. <laughs> Sanitary. 